this question on bonding and non-bonding electrons. This question says, how many bonding and non-bonding electrons are present in chlorine atom? Let's quickly solve that. Solution. The atomic number of the elements is the first thing you should know. And we know that if we count the first 20 elements in their order, chlorine is number 17. So chlorine is the 17th element. That is the atomic number is 17. It means that there are a total of 17 electrons in a chlorine atom. So let's quickly draw the structure. The first shell collects two out of the 17. Out of these 17 electrons, I've taken out two. I'm left with 15. The rest comes here. The second shell will take eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I've used a total of 10 from 17. So the remaining is seven. I'll put my third shell. Seven electrons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now this is chlorine atom. All I need to do now is to find the number of bonding electrons here and the non-bonding electrons here. I'll put my bonding electrons here. Bonding equals non-bonding. Because let's find it. Now we we'll, you have to focus on the outermost shell. That is where the exchange of electrons or bonding occurs at the outermost shell of an atom. Now, if this is my outermost shell, that is this one, the last shell here. I am not considering this inner shells. I'm considering only the outermost shell. So let me quickly remove this for clarity. I'll remove the innermost shells. I'm focusing on only this shell, the outermost shell. So you discover that this is the only place that you have shortage of electron. This place is complete. This place is complete. This place is complete. Remember, we need two, two on each of these positions to get it complete. This is the only place we have only one. And because only one is here, there is no other place that contains one except here. So it is only this spot that will take part during bonding with another atom. Only here. Why? Because this is the only place that needs to be filled up with electrons. Therefore, the total number of bonding electrons that will take part in bonding in chlorine atom is one. Only this. So the number of bonding electrons in chlorine atom is one. For the number of non-bonding electrons, that is those ones that will not take part, these two will not take part, these ones will not take part, this one will not take part. So the total of non-bonding are one, two, three, four, five, six. Six electrons. Thank you for watching. And do not forget to like, comment, subscribe if you have not done so. Thank you.